can see here how the battens go on. We're going to put screws or nails opposing each other. One here, one here, one here, one here. All the way up. All the way up. That way. That way. And we want to space them quite a ways apart, at least 24 inches. So that way when that wood expands and contracts over time, it'll have room between these screws. Between these screws. Between that one and that one there. Now how these girts go are these purlins. You can see up there. Pretty simple. They go on every 24 inches. What we do is we cut a spacer block to go between when we're setting them up. That's about 18 inches long. We put a gird up at the top, screw it in, five inch screw, put our spacer block under it, put our next girt under that. You can also start at the bottom, either way is fine. Work your way up. You'll have one spot that is a little bit narrower than the rest, usually, because it's usually not exactly 24 on center, or to the foot. So, <clears throat> that's how that goes. Here you can see a little bit better how these battens go on. Here's one that's not on yet. Pretty much just sits on that ledge about halfway, covers that gap just like that. These are three inch battens.